Hey guys and girls, welcome to Fishing Planet. Uh, we are in Rocky Lake. Um, we're going to do the Rocky Turtle Spoon Challenge. Right, so we have traveled to Rocky Lake. Um, there we spawned on the left hand side spawn uh, where we came in. And from what I've been reading and checking is the turtles are up on these, on these rocks. So I've been advised to put a spoon a spoon on and then just cross right over the rock here and then just reel it in. And when you do that, you actually grab a, a turtle. So doesn't look like anything's happening on the first cast, so we'll check it on the second. <coughs> Sorry about that. Um, yeah, no, nothing there. Maybe just increase our reading speed a bit. Um, get ourselves over here, rogue, and go. And still nothing. I think somebody's been lying to someone. Stand over here and do it from this side. There we go. It looks like we might have something. Yeah, we got our first one. Oh, that's quick. Yeah. Let's have a look at it. Okay, it's basically caught it in the shell. Now, you can't keep it, you have to release it. So let's do that, and then let's try again and see if we can get... Uh, it does show that we've caught one, so there's two left to go. And uh, yeah, sorry guys, I didn't even introduce uh, Jinx again. Jinx is here with us in the channel, we're going to be... Uh, fishing here in Rocky Lake together. Oh, that's turtle number two. That was quick. All right, so nobody's been lying to nobody. Um, <laughs> it's just I've been casting in the wrong spot. Yeah. And probably doing it, the reading in at the wrong speed as well. Um, but yeah, uh, it seems to work now. We've got two of the three now, and there we go. I think that's the third one we've just caught. Tackle was snagged. No, it came off. We shall uh, try again. It's somewhere. There we go. Let's just throw it that way. Oh, okay, I moved the rod now while I was uh, reeling, so that won't help much. Let's try it again. Might be short. There we go. Well, that's funny. That should have gone over the rock there. I think we've got the third one. Shell. A uh, normal shell. It's not even a turtle shell, but okay. That's two out of three. We still need one. Right, that's not going to be any good. Um, anyway, so I want to get this challenge done so we can start trout fishing, guys. See if we can uh, even maybe fill up our bag with 150 kilograms of trout. It's going to take some doing, but um, I'm sure we will be able to uh, 
we will be able to 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 accomplish that if we if we really put our minds to it. Okay, for some reason I think I've just finished off all the uh, the turtles that was on this rock. Alright, exactly the ground. D I doubt that though, but anyways. See if that is a, a turtle there. Definitely something else on there. Another shell. Okay. Either I've been doing something wrong, or I've uh, caught the only two turtles that's there. three there we go nice one so we've just got ourselves the rocky turtle spoon <clears throat> now you got turtle spoon and now ready to hunt for the tyranno trout guys guys and girls we shall be doing that soon I'm not going to try that right now because that spoon is going to be my only spoon I've got what I am going to do is I'm going to travel now to the other spawn, that one there on that side. So let me move over there. Uh, okay, so it's going to be this one, yeah. Um, we are in a friend's only room, and uh, yeah, time is fine. It should actually be around about five o'clock. So what I think I'm going to do is before. I'm going to move us to just before five o'clock forward the time that's four in the afternoon and then we can uh, we can do our setup let's see how it goes so first of all rod stand out right and then we uh, start with rod one and uh, we've got red room on there I don't want to put that on there I want to put some marshmallow on there. Although, actually, let's throw some of these artificial salmon eggs on the first rod. Uh, second rod. Uh, yeah, I think, yeah, let's do second rod with marshmallow. Uh, where are we now? Marshmallow, there we go. Marshmallows, we got those on. Third rod. Pull those off. Uh, let's see what else can we put on for try cheese. On line four, we've got marshmallow, and line five is the spinner, which we will put the. Uh, are we going to do spinners? Yeah, okay, let's put a golden casting spoon on there, anyways. Um, but I think we're going to run one, two, and uh, three is a sinker one. So I'm going to run the one, two, and four with the uh, lines out. So let's start with line one. Walk ourselves forward a bit and uh, get our casting. And we just put it straight over that section over there. That's line one going out. first one on and line two we shall put right over there all right put that in there then line rod number four I'm going to really why are we not oh because we haven't thrown with it yet cast there was no cost with this rod before okay, I'm on my way are you on your way in all right yep. well done well done let's get that on there I think this float is a bit on the light side I don't really like that much but anyways uh, that's in there and then uh, five should be ours with the uh, yeah the little golden spinner so that we're gonna throw this way towards the 
the log gear and let's smack it Throw three going. Put the shot. Hey there. Hello. Look at the fish I caught. Black mm -hmm. crappy. Here we go. All right, next one. Actually, I want to change this bobber, guys. This bobber is a bit on the light side. Okay, let me see. Where am I going to start with my guys? Yeah, I'm gonna see. go for the golden shiner first. Okay. Let's see. What do you have to catch all? Um I need to get a golden shiner, blue gill, black crappy, white bass, and a white sucker. Okay. So I'm gonna go for the golden shiner first. Okay, and what are you lining? What are you putting on the uh, line? Semolina balls. Similar balls, yeah, with who can sink her, so okay. Um, I'm just checking. You're gonna put where. a sink on what lining, uh, length of your uh, um, leader that you're putting on? Are you not putting uh, a leader on? I haven't looked yet, I'm still reading the description. Oh, right, okay. okay. Found in lakes and ponds and prefer quiet waters with weedy areas. Oh, joy. Yeah. Right, so we've got two. Where, there goes line two. Okay. So I'm going to go look for some weed. Um, yeah. Unfortunately, not the type you smoke. Not the smoking kind, yeah. Right, just yeah. on the right hand side of you, yeah. That'll be a good spot to look for them. Oh, I see these here. Yeah, yeah. Um, right. Okay, justice. Come sunshine. And we caught a cutthroat trout. 0.944 kilograms, $234 in the bag. Nice. Yeah, we've got to pay our two grand uh, travel fees at mm. least. So uh, I'm not what leaving until I've got that. Have? Pardon? What size bag do you have? Um, I've got the Fish Fort XL Plus. It's uh, 150 kilograms what? space. Yeah. Damn. And the, uh, I think the the max size yeah max size on the bag is 50 kilogram fish as in one of 50 yeah kilograms. yeah 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 um and the rest is here we go line two is on again and i feel like fish on. Move, i only have the 12 kilogram bag you, the you've got a 12 kilo. kilogram bag yeah that's, just, <laughs> that's what the start a small one yeah okay. well, you know you start somewhere yeah, no, 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 fully understand. Um, after my start, a small one, I bought a 70 kilogram bag. Um, and then from there, I got this um, 150 kilogram bag when I got the um, DLC. Yeah. Right, so cutthroat trout, uh, 0.637 kilograms uh, and $157 in the bag. Nice. Yeah, definitely. Right, I need to get this line in. Line three is wiggling. All right, that's on. Something is going on here on this third one of mine. Yep, there we go. Line two is running again. get that one out (laughs) 
bring that boy back home. This is this can't be that big. It's gonna be a teeny one this. Because it doesn't even make a dent on my line. Yeah, 0.26. Let's keep that. There goes number three. Come on, let's put this line back in quickly, boys. Smack it. And put this one on the stand. Come on. And go line three. Fish on. And it's a small one as well. Oh, it's a black crappie. All right. That's fine. Guys, I am going to definitely move this or change this uh, floaty. It's, it's just not big enough, heavy enough. Uh, where am I now? Floaties. Glowing floaty, that big one. Then we'll put a leader on there of half a meter. And a hook. Where's my hooks gone? There we go. Hooks. I'll put a. Let's put a one hook on there. And then we're going to chuck the marshmallows. Actually, you know what? Let's chuck spawn sack. That stuff works a treat as well. And then we'll put this boy in the water. And there goes line two again. Alright, fish on. You got anything there yet, Tinksy? Yeah, 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 yeah. Nice one. Why do I have to say fish on? Oh no, you don't have to say fish on. It doesn't make a difference. It's something that we say. <laughs> <laughs> You don't, uh, you don't have to say it. Fish stays on the hook whether you say it or not. Uh, it doesn't make a difference. That's a nice one. Point seven. So it was like a, you know, wax on, wax off kind of thing. Uh, no, no, actually, <laughs> it's not. Uh, it's just uh, it's something yeah, that started I'm started a while back with the guys on TV fishing, and then there was one guy that just went fish on, and every time he caught something, he said fish on, and right. it and stuck around. That's all it is. So, ah, uh, oh, not that one. Well, I reckon it works actually in real life fishing. Well, it's not really like, you know, like playing golf or anything where you've got to tell the guys there's a ball coming. No, but with uh, fishing, uh, especially if you're more than one fishing at the same time, it's good to let the others know. Uh, yeah, it is. But I mean, you game, just let them know that they, they normally pull up their lines. So Exactly. Or at least yeah. be aware and just move away. Yeah. Wow, it's really deep here. Is it? Mm. Yeah, I got went down to three meters. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's nice and deep. Right, another cutthroat uh, caught, uh, 0.86 kilograms, 213 bucks in the bag. Okay, so I've got a white sucker now, so that's one, one thing off the list. Nice, nice. That was the other one that wanted the semolina balls. Yeah. Now I just need the golden china, and the other three are all nano spinners that I'm going to use. Right. Okay. Now that was line one going. Finally, with the uh, salmon, artificial salmon eggs. Trophy black crappy. Nice one. Well done. Nice. <laughs> I suppose well it, I'm supposed to get that with a spinner. But fuck it, I'll take it. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. no, for sure. You take Sorry. whatever you get. I forget. Sometimes I need to watch language. Yeah, unfortunately, yeah. Uh -huh. <laughs> it's not exact. Okay, we just not PG thirteen. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> exactly. I don't know what went wrong with that uh, cast day, guys. I mean, that was a perfect cast, and then. It all just fell right in front of me, so. Alright, that's set up, five is set up. Let me just check quickly what's on what really are. What's on three? That's the sinker one. Five is the spinner, six is the bobber. Alright, now I'll go five. I'll take the golden spinner and I'll just chuck that out. 
Let's see if I can catch. Uh, let's see if I can catch Jinx. No. Yeah. Jinx bad catch. No. Tackle it the ground. So it wasn't your forehead, it was the ground. <laughs> All right, there we go. Chuck it nice and deep on the other side of the lilies. And, uh, and let's start doing our twitch and what, what. Now, there where you are, if you look on your right hand side there's those rocks yeah yeah the far rocks between the two there's two yeah that's uh, virtually next to each other if you yeah, just, yeah. if you just cast to the left of that the the one of the two the left rock just cast left of it okay try to go low ah okay okay here we go let's get line one out the water quickly there we go Fish is on. Oh, this is so nice. These guys are real good fighters. Yeah, if you've yeah. got if you've got light tackle stuff, it's even better. But I'm throwing with big rods here. These rods are heavy as hell, so they don't even feel the fish on the rods. Um, I'm enjoying this. But I'm bag filling, you know. I'm not catching to to no, gain XP or anything. I just want to get make a bit of money. Um, yeah, yeah. So, so yeah, to me, it's just get get them in the bag. I don't care how they come in, uh, how much XP I get. I still get XP irrespectively. It's just not as much as I would have had had I had a light rod, you know? Yeah, yeah. So to me, it doesn't uh, make a difference. Sorry, I'll be right back. Sure, no problem. And that's one three. Yo, yo, boy, you're gonna break my reel, yeah. This is a big one, this one. And that's in that spawn sack. Oh, this thing's run out almost to the other side of the pond, yeah. That's 42 meters out already. It's fine, it'll come my way soon. I can grab that out quickly first. And that shouldn't be that much of a deal. Yeah, this one will come out quick. Okay, that's out. Come now. Let's do the cost. There we go, and swap it with one. There we go, and then we can carry on with this one. Oh, you lie. Okay, that came loose. I really can't believe that. It fought it all the time until I picked up the, the uh, rod again. That just sucks. Alright, well... And we shall deposit it back into the lake again. I'm 
fantastic what is hold on guys let me just check this out quickly i think there's a very short lead on this thing and that's not necessary i need it to be slightly longer what do you want 60 no 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 uh 1.5 there we go oh, that's a bit better chuck it out I'm back. Welcome back. Thank you. Right, and then we put this boy on uh, number three. Get our spoon back out. Line out. <gasps> Got a golden golden shiner. Nice one. Yeah. Okay, so now I need the blue gill and the white bass. Water plants and around underwater structures. Great, now I also have the turtle mission. Great, did you complete it? No, 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 I just got the mission now. Oh, okay. Well, finish that off, that's quickly to do, uh, quick to do. So if you stand there where you are, that rock, the first rock in front of you in the water. Yeah. That's where you cast, just on the other side of that, and then you just pull that spinner straight over the rock. And there we go, got a black crappy, trophy black crappy. Um, so yeah, and then just drag it straight over the um, the rock. I didn't go slow on it, but I, what I did is I dragged it all the way to the rock. Uh, that's not good. Uh, what's that? Line two. Let's do line two quickly. No, it's not. It's line three. Damn it. Uh, oh, can you just press the right buttons, please, buddy? Come on. There we go. Get this guy out. No, you'll have to wait now, line two, I'm sorry. Oh, cool. Oh, cool. Oh. Up with a load line tension, man. It's I don't nonsense. have space for it. <laughs> you what? You don't have space for it in your bag? Yeah. Oh, that sucks. <laughs> You must maybe look at investing into a, a big yeah. cube net. Money. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, of course, I understand that completely. Money, money, money. Right, I put, uh, caught a 1.3 kilogram white sucker there. Oh, right. 
change over three again. I don't understand why that thing just told me that it, the line was, there was no slack in it. I mean, I was reading in, reading in as fast as I can, and uh, it just, the line just went slop. So I don't know what that happened there. Slack. Near, slop. Slack. Near, slop. <laughs> I know what it is in English. I don't have to speak English all the time, do I? Okay. I'll teach the rest of the of the world a bit of Afrikaans word by word. So, but now they know what slop means. Yeah. Slop pop and slop chips. Mm mm mm. So for the English speakers, that would be slack porridge. <laughs> <laughs> slack porridge. <laughs> yeah, yeah, slack porridge. <laughs> oh, crap. And slack fries. Yeah, and slack fries, yeah. All right, let's go. Let's get this boy out. I'm still upset with this line too. What was from line no, two? No, the, the fact that I'm losing fish off of it. Uh, it it's, it's the second rod I've got on my, uh, uh, what do you call it here, on the rack, uh, rod holders. And um, it just doesn't want to um, keep the fish on it when, when I actually have caught something so I'm gonna pull yeah. it out quick I just wanna see what hook I've got on this thing it's probably gonna be a bar barbless hook it's a number one hook it doesn't say barbless so let me just check I don't know why I lose it how oh, could you just reel in this thing please thank you let's have a quick look what this hook is hook is a number one hook yeah it's not a barbless hook so I don't understand how that works uh, that it um uh, keeps on coming off I mean I do strike I do put uh, the right amount of pressure on the line um, I just don't know why it's doing what it's doing maybe it's just rotten luck yeah, yeah maybe maybe not I don't know and all the other that's a nice young rainbow trout there 0.37 and it's 84 bucks yeah, I'm gonna keep it like I said you guys I'm making money now I'm not uh, here to to win any prizes except for the money the prize of money um, there's no challenges for me to do on this uh, on this lake anymore <clears throat> just here for a bit of moral support for uh, Caronia there Thank you. I don't know if it's good or bad morale that I'm catching all the fish. And sounds <laughs> a bit quiet on that side there by you, but uh, uh, yeah, I'm now on the spinner and it's uh, it is quiet. I did catch a, a trout. Nice one. But it's not on my list, so yeah, it, yeah, yeah, yeah. But it must wait until I actually need to catch a trout. Yeah. That's line one again. Oh, well, I've got something. Oh, and that's line three as well. Out. something fair sized on my line right now Colorado golden trout there we go nice one Very nice. yeah yeah definitely nice all right let's get that one over that side uh, put that on there pick up the second line I 
Oh crap, man. Well, there goes line three off into the mist. Yeah, and I lost it. Oh, no. Mm. It came straight at me and just like jumped off. The yeah, point. that's what happened with me previously as well. This line one is gone. Oh, that's the spoon. No wonder. All right, so let's get a real one out here. Uh, put that, well, not real one, rod one. Get that one out so we can put it back in the water. <coughs> right over there. Bang it in. And then change rods. There we go, and we can run our spinner back. Got something on again. Cutthroat trap. And this time I'm going to leave this rod to let it run. Um, I'll get to it when I get to it. Oh, got a cutthroat trap. Nice one. Nice one. Finally caught whatever it was. That's a white bass. Okay. That's nice. Just get that in the water. Put it there. Change to row two. And get something on that line. It's the one with the marshmallow that I keep on spitting out. got a white sucker nice you reckon you want to try where I am yeah Just trying to see how the weeds are there's not really a lot of reeds here no um, behind me by this little stump um, there's more reeds there Fish on, what the heck is this? White bass, I shall keep it and then go line three. And that's the spawn sack again, it's the spawn sack, uh, and it's the bass that likes it the most. Oh no, don't you want to grab this other line for me quickly? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, uh, this time I'm staying with you, buddy. I don't care. This other one can go mull as much as it wants to. Yeah. I am bringing this thing home. Okay, try this side. Even though this beeping is annoying as hell. Strike down that, okay. It's one of them things, boys. Whatever's on this line is coming out. Let's just check what reel I've got in here because it doesn't look like this reel could take a lot of strain. Because this thing just keeps on running my line out. Come on, another one. Of what? <laughs> Another trout. Nice one. 
Now this lake is, is filthy with all the, and it's going to get away again. No, it doesn't. Yippee. Right, uh, that's this filthy full of uh, trout on this. That's a, that's a the trout lake though. I mean, if you don't catch trout here, you're stupid. I think if you take a, a normal car tow rope and you tie, tie a rock to it and you throw it in there, you'll catch a trout. You don't, well, that's to be, you don't even have to be that good. Quite a claim. Yeah. Okay, I'm going to tighten up this thing now. I must now either damage my reel or I must take the fish out. The one of these two. I am, I'm not going to just stand here the whole day. And not get anywhere. That thing's going up river already. It's, it's at the pond. Hello, what are you? Something that wants to get away. <clears throat> I don't know what this is, but this thing is giving me a heck of a fight. I'm trying to pull it in closer, but I mean. Even with this, this reel of mine's drag fully fuss. I mean, that, that, that just keeps on going. Yeah, I also have one here that's now very resistant to coming in. Yeah. I mean, doesn't he know that he's got a lot of friends waiting in the bag? He can just come and be with his friends. Maybe get the memo. Probably didn't. There we go, back up to 24 meters again. Turn the hell around and come this way. Ah, nonsense. What happened? No, it's off the line again. That's just bull. Oh. That is bull. Utter nonsense. That thing was hooked and set and everything. Oh, could you just shut up? Just take this line out. It's the same one that was going on earlier. He goes that same damn rod again. No, I'll snap it, I promise you. Before this thing gets out or off the hook again, I will definitely snap this rod, the reel, the line, everything. I don't care. It is not going to get off that hook again. Ugh, come on! Mine is so close. On five meters constantly. I had mine on seven meters and then all of a sudden just turned around and it went again. I was over 20, I think 23 or something like that meters and then all of a sudden, Great. oh, you've lost it. It come off the line. Nonsense. Yeah, no, it's back to 10, 13. Yeah, I know. Whatever's on this line, I need to check this, this reel when I get it out again. If it comes off the line or whatever, I need to see what reel this is. 
because this wheel has got no no catching power whatsoever. Yeah. I mean, whatever this is that I've got on the line, and it's oh, nice one, nice one. One point three kilograms trophy trout, very nice. Sweet. Yep. Okay. So yeah. The rod and the reel is both going close to the red, but the line is not even half. Yeah. So I don't know what's going on here. But it's fine. Let's just keep on going. And this thing's on 23, kilo, 23 meters, and it's not coming back. Yeah. Closest I think I've had it now is 12. No, it's not even 17 meters. And that was just it. Seventeen, eighteen, seventeen, sixteen, fifteen, fourteen, twelve. I don't even see the water, that's how high I've got this rod lifted. And it's out eventually. A eight hundred gram trout? No what? ways, not a chance. There's something wrong with the setup. What have we got here? Is this the telefloat? Yeah, that's the number four one I've got. What's this, this reel? Well, yeah, no, forget it. Forget it, forget it, forget it, forget it. Yank that thing off. Let's get a better reel in here. 3.6 kgs, that's better. Snap that on there. Um, now let's just check the line. It's the same roughly. 3.6 floor 86. There we go. Just chuck that on there. And then uh, put our glow on there. And. Uh, Half a meter titanium, and then we need to put a hook on you. Um, number one, and marshmallows. No spawn sack. That's what's on. That was was on there. Right. So let's have a look and see what it does now. If it's going to do the same as what it's been doing the whole time. Can you? Thank you. All right, so I've got that on. <coughs> Three floaties in the water. Okay, that is line four, so that needs to get back on the. Uh, there we go. Five is the one I'm after. Okay, now we're just going to spin straight over uh, that away. There we go. Catching anything there, Jinx? I got another trout. Oh, you should let us know when you catch stuff. There's no point in being in here and it's only me talking. Um, then the people okay. won't even know you, yeah. Oh. Yeah, I suppose that's one of the prerequisites of being a YouTuber is uh, the constant chatter. Well, not so much, but I mean, we are catching together. So, I mean, yeah, yeah, it shows on the bottom there that you just caught a 400 gram young rainbow trout, but I miss that when I'm busy fighting uh, with fish alone. Yeah. So. It's like I'm standing on my own uh, next to the waters. I'm just not sure where to. Call, uh, wait, there's another something. And another trout. Oh, there you go. <laughs> I'm going to fill my bag up with trouts and not one single bluegill or white bass. 
Well, I want this. I caught you on the left hand side by me. So if you want to come stand here. Um, oh, sure. Yeah, definitely. So where on the left side do All you right. just pass the spinner? You go past my rocks, um, past my uh, rods, I mean. Yeah. To this bush. There's a spawn sack bush here. You walk straight up all the way to the left. You're where I'm standing, right? Okay. Yeah, yeah. Now in front of you, you see there's a log, not this first log that's that yeah. Further on, the second one that runs into the water yeah. like it. Try and cast just on the other side of that. Okay. That's where I've been hitting the uh, the white okay. bass. So you walk all the way to the front of the rods. There you go, right there. And then chuck it out as far as you can into that little... Let me see if... I don't know if you can see my line. Um, no. But it's okay, I got it. Let me just check with you. I'm going to try and cast my... Yeah, right I, there. I, right I, there. Yeah, cast between the rock and... No, no, the... no, that's hundreds. Right there is the spot. That's where you want to be. And what are you catching with? Um, nano spinner. Oh, okay. Uh, you have to do it on the spinner, though. I would for like it, for to. For it to count. No. Oh, okay. I got something, though. Oh, nice one. Let's see what it is. And look, it's a trout. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but it's fun. I'll just keep going. Yeah, that's what I'm doing. I'm just fishing because for the sake of fishing. That's yeah, what yeah. We do. Okay, I was just snagged there on something. Don't know what that was. Anyways. And chuck it into the mouth there. Right to the inlet. There on the river. And then okay, uh, another something. Hit the ground. Oh look, it's another trout. Is it? Okay. Yeah. <laughs> I never thought you would catch trout in this dam though. I mean that's such a surprise to me. <laughs> yeah, you with your tire and rope. Yeah. I hey, got another something. Um, let me guess, trap. Uh, yes, in fact. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. That's why I'm yeah, to be honest, just catching the trout. That's all I want to do. Can we see if I trout. can like, get way past there and Oh that was horrible. Oh luckily I was looking down at the water, so Oh good. Yeah. That's that's great. You shouldn't have seen that. Yeah. Oh, did they cast at the same time? <laughs> at the same place? Oh, really? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, I got something. Okay, so we didn't catch something at the same time either. Nah. Are you, doing, are you doing a fast reel or a slow reel or what? Slow. Slow, slow, slow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah I'm, I was one up on that slow reel. Oh, uh, just in case you didn't notice, I've got another trout. Oh, I saw it. Four, 400 <laughs> grams. Mm. And I saw that atrocious cast as well. No, no, you didn't see anything. I saw that one. You saw nothing. <laughs> I saw that one. Now, was that stuck to your boot or what? Uh, no, this last one, uh, now that I cast, now I did that on purpose. Okay, so we're back online three before, again. Just before the log now. Oh, okay. Maybe the trout would hang out in the weeds. Yeah. No, 
Oh, that's better. Oh, cool. Something, something, something. Cut through. Try it there. Actually, I should take out these other lines. Get that boy out. That's the one that was running earlier. And uh, I didn't catch anything, but I'm sure that this day the hook was empty now. All right, so that can go back out there. Um, and put it on number one. And then change this with two. Get that boy out. Hello, something. On your line. Mm. Nice one. It's not as feisty as a trout, so there's hope. Yeah, yeah. Oh, there's nothing. Oh, that sucks. That was weird. It didn't even give me a message or anything. Yeah, that is weird. Hmm. Uh, something. Here we go. I don't know, this looks like a trout again. Yes. Well, it's a new personal record. Oh, there you go. It's actually quite pretty. Some reason of mine, this this floaty of mine doesn't want to drop. No, just get it. Out. Uh, this has got to be another chart. Yep. And I've got another cutthroat as well. Oh, still gotta get this line one out. Oh, you must be joking. Stick that thing over there. There we go, 899 grams, cutthroat, $222, nice. Wow, nice. nice. Well, in this time that we've been out here fishing now, the last hour, yeah, I've caught 15 kilograms of fish. Good grief. Uh, and it's, and I mean, it's not like it's a five kilo, three, five kilogram fish that I've caught. And the, most of them under a kilogram, half a kilogram at most. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, definitely have. And there we go. Challenge complete. Trout Master 2. Okay, it's a nice. certain number of trout. Got me two fish coins. That's uh, that's brilliant. Very very nice. That's very okay, well, I'm going sure. to try the side again. Yep, in between the grass. Oh, you go for it. Um, it's floaty. I need to get this thing sorted out. 
this float is not uh, <coughs> not set at the right depth it's too deep all right so let me just check what is it on uh, oh yeah it's two and a half meters that will never do we need to get it at about a meter there we go then we can jock it back in there yeah, if you cast with a sinker, then you'll see the depth. Um, no, 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 no. I, I, I normally have my depth set properly, but um, for some reason, I had... Uh, <coughs> I've lost this one. Oh, what's going on here? Okay, I had a bit of a weird one going on there now, guys. I don't know what happened. Um, the jinx, you can still hear me, right? Yeah. Okay, now my whole game just froze up there for a second. I don't know why. Oh. Probably to tell me to uh, end this episode. Oh. And because uh, we've been catching for an hour. Wow, it doesn't feel like it. Yeah. Hey? But yeah, let me let me clean out the rods as they come out, and then uh, we'll go from there. Right, so that's another one. Uh, let's put that rod away. And then there's two more, so let's go rod two. Let's just check out what's going on in this thing. That's the one with the salmon balls or salmon eggs. There we go. There we go. There we go. Fish on. Nice. Yeah. And I'm bringing this boy home before it even decides to run. Cut throat half a kilogram. That's not bad. All right. So we'll put that rod away. Take the third rod and just give it a bit of a shake. Wow, you just disappeared now. Did I? Yeah. Okay. Wait, you're back. Now you're back, you're back. And another trout. It could be because I've changed the uh, rods, obviously. <coughs> oh, that's it, yeah. It normally does that when, when you change rods or you go into your inventory, then uh, it does stuff oh, like okay. that. Nice one. So you still got the same size bag, that, what is it, 15 kilogram bag or whatever. Yeah. Right, that's it guys. Um, I think we're going to pack it up. And uh, call it a day. That was a, a really nice one. So just for you guys, so you can see, I'm going to leave the the lake for now, so we can see what we had for a catch of the day. So yes, we'll leave, and we got three thousand three hundred eighty-eight dollars and eight hundred ten XP. Um, yeah, and then we've got the two challenges, Rocky Lake Cleanser number two and Trout Master two. So, and all in all, a good day is fishing. Yeah, well I'm done. Really, yeah, really happy with that. And how much have you caught up until now? Um, I currently have 10 kilograms out of 12. 10, okay. okay. Yeah, still looking for the bluegill and the white bass. Uh, maybe it's the time of day that's not uh, right. Yeah, I think so. Because they're both kind of predators, I think. Mm. So it could be dusk and dawn. Yeah, but if you just press T, you can forward it on to the time that you need. Yeah. But uh, guys, yeah, we'll most probably catch her on the next uh, fishing adventure together. Um, don't know which lake it'll be on, but um, thank you for watching. Uh, yeah. Please do us a favor and uh, subscribe to the channel there, guys. 
like the video if you liked it obviously uh, and then ring the bell as well so you can get notified of future episodes of us fishing together all right have a good day guys okay bye bye jinx